Hey there everybody, I'm Mikey G and today we'll be taking a closer look at the Soho Urban Artist tote bag. Soho claims that this bag is a sturdy, water resistant bag that will withstand all conditions. So uh, I want to put it through a few torture tests here and see just how much it can take before it breaks and prove it. So the first thing I want to test today is how much weight can the Soho Urban Artist tote bag hold? I filled this one bag here to the brim with all different kinds of art supplies and it's coming in at about 19 pounds. If I was to give the bag a shake, you can see that it's, it's staying together just fine, it's holding the art supplies secure, and everything's in good shape. But I have a feeling I can load a lot more than 19 pounds into this bag. And my question is just how tough is it and how much weight can it take? Uh, what I'm going to start by doing is adding weights in. I'm going to start with about 20 pounds because that's what we already know it can hold. And uh, shaking it a little bit and seeing if we see any signs of damage. I'm going to add just uh, another 5 pounds here, bring it up to 25, and we're going to give it a little shake. Alright, it seemed to do just fine with about 25 pounds. Let's bring it up to 30. My job is getting heavier by the bag load. Now let's move on to 35 pounds and see if that does anything. I think I'm going to need a bigger weight. Uh, the bag is now at almost 60 pounds. Uh, we're going to see how much the bag and, well, my arm can take. Overall, it's pretty impressive. 60 pounds and uh, no damage. So I think we're ready to move on to the next test. Let's see how it takes uh, some hits, some licks. Let's, um, I don't know, run it over with a car. I got a bad feeling about this. Besides a few tire marks, I'd say it's still working just fine. The bottom's still flat, everything's still secure. All right, so I think we're in pretty good shape. Um, I think we're ready to move on to the next test. Uh, let's do some water resistance tests, shall we? So now what we're gonna do is test how it holds up under some water conditions. And I think I'm gonna simulate some rain using this garden hose. Uh, I'm gonna put a spiral bound notebook in there and get it really wet and see if it damages the notebook inside. And uh, just to protect myself, I will put on this banana suit. Is this right? I, I feel like it's like a wearable road map. Okay, now let's see how our notebook did or didn't do. Whoa. Bone dry. So I wanna kick this up a notch. Meet me inside. We're gonna do another water-based test now. Uh, I'm gonna put a dry notebook into a, another dry um, Soho bag, and we're gonna see how well it does. Now, I wanna point out, this bag is not advertised as waterproof. It's water resistant, but I wanna see how far it can go. Hey, look at that, it floats. If you drop it in a lake, you'll have a chance to grab it before it's too late. Okay, well, while it's floating at least, everything's dry. I don't have high hopes for this one. Some water got in on the bottom there, but uh, the book for the most part's fairly dry. Let's see how the paper did. Yeah, the paper's all dry. So there you have it, the Soho Urban Artist tote bag is a fairly resilient little tool. We put it through some pretty extreme tests here and it's nice to see that it holds its own. With all these bags being made, especially overseas, that will fall apart on you after a week, let alone a year, it's nice to know that there's some things out there that will last you a long time. So we hope you enjoy this episode of Prove It, and we'll see you again next time. Uh, Mike, you're not getting the bag wet. What?